What's going on guys, beautiful people. Today we're here on Melrose. We're doing a bunch of little things today, so it's not just the Melrose vlog, but we're doing a bunch of different things. And today we're starting it off at Wipe the Hype. I quickly wanna show you guys how I do a little bit of my reselling pretty much. I'm not the biggest reseller. I do resell here and there to make a little profit, which I do. But pretty much we're going here to pick up some shoes that have actually just been finished earlier today. And I'm gonna quickly show you guys the shoes and what I'm gonna do with them and like how I'm gonna make a little profit. So if you follow me. What's going on guys? So before we get into the video, I have a quick announcement for you guys. If you don't know already, the new SneakerCon app is here. Click the link in the description to download it. This is the new and best sneaker marketplace online. Everything is legit. And I'm one of the main brand ambassadors now, which I'm very honored to be. So make sure to download it if you haven't already. And also make sure to comment down below what you think of the app after you downloaded it and also follow SneakerCon on Instagram to get updated with new stuff that's coming out. I do believe that it only works for iPhone models above the 7. That's just because there's new technology that allows you to scan and legit check all the shoes which is really cool. So if you have anything lower, I'm sorry, but if you have a newer phone, make sure you go download it. It's pretty much the future of sneakers. This app is really huge and that's why I joined the team. So make sure you guys download it if you haven't already. It'll be in the description. And with all that being said, I got something super quick to show you guys. I did recently just get this really sick Gucci side bag and I gotta give a huge shout out to somebody, just a quick plug. I gotta give a huge shout out to my boy Grant. He's located in NYC. You guys may already follow him, but his Instagram will be right here. He blessed me with this bag for a great price. It's super sick. And he has a really dope Instagram account as well where he posts a lot of streetwear and fashion photos. So make sure you guys go follow him. His thing will be on the screen. Thank you Grant for sending this to me ASAP and for the great price. And it's like pretty much brand new. It's just like a little side bag. Just wanted to show you guys this stuff. So huge shout out to him. I had to give him a plug one time. So with all that being said, let's get on into this video. If you guys don't already know, I'm here with my boy. Wipe the hype on my rose. I come here a lot for different things to clean my personal shoes as well as clean some shoes that like I bought and then I'm gonna sell. I got these all for steals. He cleaned them up very nice for me. A bunch of used V2s and a couple of Jordan 1s. And pretty much, I paid them a little bit, their costs and stuff, to clean these up, make them look really, really nice. And what I'm gonna do now, is I'm pretty much gonna try to go make profit on these, a little over what I paid, because I got them for like steals, because they were used. But pretty much, if you guys are ever looking for a place to come quickly clean your shoes, yeah, your shoes. same day turnaround if you really need it, I really appreciate it. No worries. Uh, so our address is 7364 Moes Avenue. We're a block over from round two. We're two blocks over from Cool Kicks LA. Like the fear of God. Oh. All right, thanks, bro. Appreciate yeah. it. My bad. It was so good. I, was so good. I like your thing. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Yeah, yeah. I All like right. that Amiri Amiri though. Thank you, yeah. Shout out to the homies. Yeah. Nice meeting you guys. All right, nice meeting you. Yeah. Uh, my boy, from, from, from Bay Area, that's yeah. where we uh, See the chain, guys. Yeah, bro, uh, this one too. I'm trying to keep ooh, it under, though. Yeah, I'm like trying to be careful, that. yeah. At Hollywood.hype on IG. Yeah. He's catch me on Melrose. These guys are big sneaker resellers. I actually met you through SneakerCon. Yep. I got one of the shows. We linked. We exchanged them. Cool guy. Legit buyer. Thank you. Thank you. Yep, yep. So yeah, I have this stuff. I don't know if they're going to buy it, but pretty much, guys, I bought this stuff used a little bit ago, and I got it cleaned up, wiped the hype, and I'm pretty much going to try to make some profit on it. I'm telling them how to resell a little bit. So if you guys want any of this stuff, I don't know if you do. Yeah. What do you It'll think? be an off-camera deal, but yeah, for sure. we'll make something happen. We'll be right back. What's up, guys? What's up, bro? How are you? Good, how are you? Yeah, I'm good. I'm good, good. Yeah. Thank you. All right, guys. So I want to say that I spent 580, if I'm correct, on those three shoes. I still have one more that they passed on, which is all good. I spent 580 on those shoes and I just made 780, so I made 200 bucks. Now that's not like the biggest profit. I know you guys are gonna be like, that's like nothing compared to like the stuff that you spend and the stuff that you buy, but it's starting somewhere. So that's just a tip for you guys. This whole video isn't gonna be about reselling and stuff, but we are going to be hitting up a store right now. I'm gonna tell you guys when we get there, it's very, very exciting. They have some new stuff that just came in. And I gotta give a huge shout out to my boy, by the way. If you guys need pretty much anything in LA, you guys looking for some V2s, some Jordans, anything, Vans, Fear God Vans, my boy Kahan right here. What's up guys, how you doing? You guys can check out his Instagram. He has a fire feed with a bunch of Supreme and bags and shit, all that stuff that you guys wanna get. Please make sure to go check out his Instagram. Me and him have been hanging out a little bit and he's just been helping me get into reselling because he's really into it. But if you guys want anything fire, make sure to go check out his account. All this stuff's ready. Just DM him to buy it, PayPal, it's very legit. 
So just keep that in mind. Recently, I've just sat back and tried to be grateful for everything that I have and just try to be more grateful for the friends that you have, all the homies, the family, everything that you have. But not everything depends on materialistic items. Like all this stuff is cool, but what really matters is your family and friends and everybody that you know. Yeah, we're gonna get today started. Today's gonna be a dope video and I'm excited to bring you guys along. But yeah, let's go to the store and let's cash out. All right guys, so I don't know if these homies wanna be filmed, but I just thought this was really, really cool. And for the buddy here, Kahan, he drove over the curb. But they're selling lemonade, right? They're selling lemonade, they're right there. I don't know if they're supporters or not. I like that. I have some, yeah, I have those at my house. We got multiple flavors. How long have you been out here? Two hours? How much have you sold? 22 of them? Damn. How old are you? 10? Are you into sneakers and stuff? Are you into shoes and stuff? Or like, do you like shoes? A little bit? All right, yeah, that's how I was. Dang, I, I used to do this, but I wasn't that young. I started doing it when I was like 13, 14. So I respect that. You're working hard. What are you trying to save up for? Just just hold on to it? All right, all right, that's for you. Good, you can keep it. You're good. Oh, really? Yeah, you're good. Yeah, good working hard. It's hot out here, but you're doing well. But yeah, speaking of that, I used to sell lemonade in my neighborhood a while ago, before I was doing YouTube or anything. And that's really cool, that little homie, just because he's standing out here, it's really, really hot. He doesn't even live here, he lives in New York, but I think he was with the homie. But yeah, he's really happy now. But I don't know, that just felt good. I wanted to just give the homie some money. We got Chateau LaCroix. Is it LaCroix? La LaCroix? LaCroix or whatever? They should sponsor me. I actually have these at my house, so. But yeah, now we're gonna go to the store. I just wanted to quickly do that. That was really cool. I made the homies little day. He's not in the shoes yet though, but maybe he'll save that money, check out my YouTube and get in the shoes. So I'll see you guys at the store. All right guys, so we're at the next location and now we're at Louis Vuitton inside the dressing room with all of the drip that I'm looking to pick up today. Wow, okay, so just to run it down, we'll start with these. I know you guys may like flame me, like just starting off with these. This is not the exact one I'm getting. There's another one that I'm gonna try on. But if you guys know, I love to wear, it's really weird, I don't know, a lot of people do it though. I love wearing the Fear God shorts or the Just Dawn shorts with compression tights underneath. It's like a workout thing, like, I wear when I work out, but I've just been doing it a lot lately because it's comfortable, it sort of looks good, but like I'm always wearing just simple black ones. So Louis Vuitton actually just came out with compression tights, compression pants. And yes, this is a very different purchase, it's very weird, but first of all, this one is like a picture of the moon, which I'm not really feeling. They have another pair of these with like, it looks like a denim, and they're compressed and they're compression tights pretty much, and they have 3M Louis Vuitton going all up and down. So that may be a move, it's something different though, so I'll have to see. If you guys know about this, Jake and Miles actually got this for me when they came here without me, and they spent money on my card, they got this one. This was the last drop of like the Louis Vuitton stuff. But this is the newest one, and it matches some other stuff that I'm looking at. Myself and Kahan may get these. They're really, really sick. It's like a 3M sort of scratchy material with a nice Vachetta tan leather going up and down, which is really nice. All right, so shout out to my plug at Louis Vuitton. She helped me get all this stuff. Most, most of this stuff is sold out, but this is the other pair. I like these a little bit more. They are very weird. They look really weird, but I'm gonna see how they look on me. I don't know how I'm gonna wear them though if I don't have shorts. I'm just gonna have to try them on. <laughs> just this compression. This is a t-shirt. This is very popular. A lot of people have got this recently. It's sold out currently at this location, except for this one. Size medium, I believe. So I'm gonna try this one on. I'll just try it on right now. By the way, the drip. I love my new chain, guys. If, I mean, you guys have seen it because my mom reacted to it, but it's really, really sick. So we're gonna try the shirt on. Doesn't look that bad, huh? But, what's the price on it? 700, I'm gonna guess. 650. 650. 
<laughs> it's a lot, guys. It's for like a plain shirt, but it looks good. It's simple, but I mean, again, Louis Vuitton, anything at Louis Vuitton, it's very expensive. But I'm just trying to see if I like how it looks on me. Like this is a little short just because my arms are so long, but I think it looks pretty good. So the final thing that I was looking at, and I know it's only been a couple of things, but trust me guys, this adds up. This backpack right here, this is a part of the last Kim Jones collection. This with this is a part of the last Kim Jones collection. Everybody was actually sort of thrown off because this was supposed to be a part of the last Kim Jones collection. And I got the Danubi and I got the belt on my birthday. But this is the new backpack. They only got one of these at Rodeo. This is one of the biggest Louis Vuitton stores in the country. So I'm assuming a bunch of other stores didn't get them. She pretty much just came in here and told us how. Pretty much this was on hold for somebody and they didn't come in time or before B Sneak. And let's just say your boy swooped it. This is a Josh. This is perfect size in my opinion. They have a lot of different and newer models. There's one that sort of looks like crunched and squished and it has like a big thing coming off the front. But this is like perfect. This is so sick. It's a new material. It has a cheddar tan lining. It even has a tag on the side, which I think is a very nice touch. Retail on this bad boy is, uh, I'm not gonna discuss it, but this is a lot. I really like it though, just cause it's very comfortable. I hate when they do leather straps. They usually don't do leather straps now, but it's very, very comfortable. It looks very nice. It's just different. It's different than the usual black Louis Vuitton like backpack. And then it has like a comfortable back, which is really sick. Cause my other Josh, I have, if you guys have seen it, it's like black with the different patches on it. But that one has like a leather back and it's a little uncomfortable. And then also one more thing I have to let you guys know about. She's currently looking for it right now. But if there's one more of these here, I think I wanna give it away to you guys in this video only though. So if you guys wanna win this, she's gonna go see if there's one more. I'm hoping there's a brand new one. But if you guys wanna win this, and I'm gonna give it away to you guys, you have to smash the like button right now on this video. Let's hit 20,000 likes on this video. My boy Kahan's getting tired, I can tell. But thank you, but yeah, if they have one more guys, I'm gonna buy it and then you guys have to get to 20,000 likes. If not, then I'm just gonna hold on to it and keep it, but I don't know, if you guys want this, this is a card holder, and pretty much it's a part of the Kim Jones last collection. They do have a couple of these left, I believe. Most of the backpacks and the other stuff are sold out, like the Danubi sold out, but they may have this little card holder for you guys. So if you want that, leave a like down below and subscribe to my YouTube channel. You gotta leave a like and you gotta subscribe as always. We just hit 500K, so thank you guys. I love you, thank you for all the support. So I am probably, first off, I don't know if I should get this shirt. I think it looks pretty good. I mean, is it worth 700 bucks though? Mm. Your boy cashed out. We got bag, leather goods, shirt, clothing. Huge shout out to Louis Vuitton and all the love there. They're all sold out pieces. So huge shout out to my plug there. Shout out to her. She'll be in the thumbnail. We got a nice thumbnail, but let's head over. If you guys don't know this area, this is Rodeo Drive. Beautiful Rodeo Drive. This is like famous to LA, Beverly Hills. 